So good morning everybody, we are here, we're on the way up to Scotland and we've got a bit of an exciting trip, haven't we? Where are we off to first? Scotland. 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 <laughs> so yes, we are playing golf for the next three days. So we are actually playing, later on today, we're playing the Torrance and the Kittox courses, so we're staying at the Fairmont. Fairmont, yeah. Tomorrow we have King's Barnes and Carnoustie. Carnoustie. And Thursday we have Glen Eagles playing on the Queen's course and doing uh, YouTube videos on the PGA course. Yes. Yes. Construction, uh, construction, they're doing some renovation work, shall I say. So we're doing this um, along with golf breaks. So golf breaks, you can't see them. Um, it, it's probably the biggest, if not the biggest, travel golf company in Europe. So they are um, a fantastic outfit. They've really helped us out with this trip as well, help planning this trip. Plenty of things on the horizon. And they're also in the States now as well, so check about who are in yeah, the States as well. So yeah, we're actually so. filming some courses. Some, uh, we're going to film all the courses. We're going to make sure we uh, capture loads of great content for YouTube and for the website. Yep. Um, it's going to be some good golf. I'm maybe. looking forward to it. I hope the wind stays down a little bit. I don't want it to be too windy. I've got a golf course for that. Golf got, courses are really hard. We've also got a cameraman who's on as well. We've got my dad helping us out today. So uh, he's going to be here along making it easier for our... You right there, Terry? So you're okay, yeah, Terry. fine. fine. <laughs> This is you talking. Over the next few days, that's for sure. We got so we've had two and a half hours travelling. We've probably got another two and a half hours before we get there. We teen off around three, uh, two courses, bag of food, a couple of coffees. Um, should we get moving? And some ducks. And some ducks. <laughs> I think we'd say hello. Here we go. <laughs> It's nice. Not bad, eh? Not bad. Look at the view. Beautiful. So, we've arrived. A little bit later than we thought, but the place looks amazing. The hotel looks pretty good. Pretty impressive. And we, I'm sure we'll get a bit of a view of St Andrews right down in the corner down there. So it's just a matter now of checking in and then um, pretty much gets around the golf course. Okay, so let's check the room out. So we've all got our own rooms, which is good. And it looks like we've got a pretty good view, so plenty of space in the room here. Let's go and check the golf course out, the most important part. Let's have a look. So as you can see, we've got a great afternoon for it. A little bit of cloud around. But the clubhouse is, as you can see, just down there. So we're going to get uh, down there shortly. A bit of a warm-up and then on the golf course. Excited. Just hope the weather stays like this. One of the most important things for me, got to have a nice cup of coffee in the morning. Nice espresso there to wake me up. Even got a nice sort of jacuzzi looking bath here. Brilliant.
Okay, right, we're a few holes into the vlog. Hole number, I think we're on the 13th of the Torrance. Um, some good shots so far, so make sure when you watch the vlog. Um, what was I going to say there? I can't remember what I was going to say. It's the 14th hole. 14th hole, there we go, 14th hole. Some good shots going on. I've got 9 iron into 141 yards. This one's about to go close. It's either really close or over, or over the back. back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. I actually said on buggy cam there that I think you might knock it through the back. If you do that, you could be dead. Or I think that's in the hole. You could I be think. in the hole. I think that's in the hole. Which one would you prefer? Um, I think it's in the hole. You prefer I'm, that I'm in the hole? That, I'm going to say that's in the Are hole. Are you sure? At least six inches away. Well, at, 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 least, <laughs> at least six <laughs> inches away in the hole. <laughs> Okay Andy, 428 yards, par 4, big bunker in the middle of the fairway at 290. Tight right, out of bounds right, looks like a bit of room left so I'm actually going to aim left of that bunker and I'm going to go for a cut here. He's going to go left of this bunker, here, with a cut. So a little tip for you, when the out of bounds or when the trouble is on the right, play away from it. So rather than aiming and trying to draw it away from the trouble, play away from it and fade it back. I feel is a more comfortable one for me to do. Fading it back towards the bunker. <laughs> Interesting. I agree with what you're saying. You've still got to think about the bunker. <laughs> Alright. We've done exactly that and hopefully it's just going to go a little bit further right than that. Be perfect. Perfect. I think, should, I think that bunker's further than further than 290. Is it? Maybe. Okay. Right, Pierce. Well, you, how you think? How are you going to play this one? How you see this you know, one? I, I'm going to do something pretty similar to yourself. Definitely going to hit it the left. Better line in from there as well. And it's slightly down the right hand side. Let's just see if we can catch it. Just dropping. Overcooked it. Just landed a few yards in from that out of bounds there by the looks of it. I know, it might be tight and it's gone around the corner. Thank you very much. Smells <laughs> 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 nice. What have you got there? Like you said, it's a goat's cheese, beet rind, yeah. tomato. Beautiful. Um, and it's like a bit of tomato jam in there, I think. Tomato jam in there, yeah. 
Scallops for me. And Mr. Ward, have you got Duck. a dessert there? We've got a dessert now. Looks like a dessert, doesn't <laughs> it? That looks nice, doesn't it? It's tremendous. <laughs> yeah, got some pate in there as well. Beautiful. Duck liver pate. Looks like a piece of cake there, isn't it? <laughs> right, steak was a good choice there. This is brilliant because I actually said on the golf course I wanted two steaks, didn't I? <laughs> What have you got? I've got two steaks. I've got the beef cheek. The beef cheek looks beef lovely. Cheek with the red wine jus. That's just and amazing. The cod fillet with chunky chips and asparagus and something else on there. Peppercorn and a beautiful. Let's get stuck in. <laughs> and done. Brilliant. Some salmon to I'm, hit, I'm hitting the thumbs well. up. I'm hitting the thumbs up for the, on the video for the uh, food. Yeah. <laughs> We've got the uh, seal of seal of approval over there. Mmm. Looking away for us then now. Well, that's made It's going down. So we got well. a champagne mousse and biscuit. Champagne mousse. Beautiful. Mm, very nice. Who's got? Oh, wow. <laughs> mm. Mm. He was right. Still eating? Yeah. Oops. Cheese and biscuits now. Your dad forced me into it. I wasn't having any of them, but. Uh, well, eat that one, you'll be alright. <laughs> Minibus is here. Minibus is here to take us back. Yeah. So after a really nice meal, that was a beautiful dinner, beautiful game of golf. It's back to the hotel to sort all the footage out, <laughs> yeah, all footage and out. then uh, get ready for tomorrow's charge job. Charge all the batteries back charge up. Charge the batteries. Charge to get rid of the camera sorted, and then early start for Glen Eagles and Carnoustie tomorrow. See if we can beat the and rain. And Kings Barnes as well. We're going to play Glen Eagles on Thursday instead. There we go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> King's Barnes in the morning first. So thanks for watching guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Post your comments down below. Thanks for watching. <laughs>